The Galapagos Islands are found 600 miles off the coast of Ecuador in the Pacific Ocean. This remote archipelago is home to many unusual species of animals found nowhere else on the planet, like the Galapagos cormorant that eventually became flightless because it evolved in an environment with no predators. And the marine iguana, who developed the ability to dive deep into the ocean to eat algae from the surface of rocks. But the most famous inhabitant of these islands is the world's largest tortoise, the gentle, herbivorous Galapagos tortoise that can reach lengths over four feet and weigh over 500 pounds. The Galapagos Islands were formed in the middle of the ocean by volcanic activity, with five separate ocean currents flowing towards the islands and none flowing away. It is thought that millions of years ago, animals rafted there on floating debris. With no way to leave the islands, in order to survive in the mostly harsh environment, the animals had to adapt. For the tortoises, these adaptations are evident in their body size, the length of their legs and necks, and the shape of their carapace. What's a carapace? The carapace is the hard upper shell of a turtle or tortoise. Made of bone covered in keratin, it provides both support and protection for the animal. There are 11 living species of Galapagos tortoises, and many of them have developed unique physical characteristics that allow them to thrive in different habitats. For example, the giant tortoises that inhabit older island habitats that support lush plant growth have typical short legs and necks and the dome-shaped carapace shared by smaller species of tortoises. But tortoises that live on dry islands with rocky substrate and little ground vegetation have longer necks and limbs and a saddleback carapace that allows them to reach high above the ground to eat from tree-formed cactuses that would be out of reach for a more typically shaped tortoise. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our Wild Science with HEB playlist to learn more about adaptations.